The North Field is 25 kilometers to the north, 51 kilometers to the east, 6,000 kilometers square. Out here is 45 degrees centigrade. And there, minus 160. Qatar will be the biggest LNG producer in the world. By the end of this decade, we will total our production 77 million tons. We are now the only country who supply gas to three continents at the same time, Asia, Europe, and North America. LNG today is a commodity that everybody wanted. And this is why it creates a strong position for Qatar gas in the map of the gas in the whole world. Qatar gas first production started in late 1996, early 1997. Our shareholders include Qatar Petroleum, uh, ExxonMobil, Total, uh, Mitsui and Marubeni. Uh, when we started up, the, the trains uh, gave us six million tons. We undertook a debottlenecking uh, project that raised our capacity to uh, 10 million. Uh. The scale of Katagas is quite difficult to comprehend sometimes. In 1990, the first uh, delivery to Japan was, was penned. Um, since then, they delivered 900 cargoes to Japan, over 250 cargoes to Spain, the US. It's a considerably sized organization. Qatar sits on the largest gas accumulation in the world. The North Field holds uh, 900 trillion cubic feet uh, of reserves. Uh. North Field Bravo as a complex houses all the wellheads, and the processing facilities to dehydrate the gas and allow for its transportation. The gas that we produce comes under natural drive. That means you do not need any pumping to get it to the shore. We've got three offshore unmanned platforms, around 30 wells, and that feeds the gas into the two pipelines that brings the gas here to Ras Lafan. Once it gets to the site here, we then go through the slug catcher, which separates out the condensate from the gas, and then we take out some of the contaminants in the LNG itself and start cleaning it up. Finally, we end up with very pure methane. The methane goes into basically a very, very large refrigerator. We cool it in three different steps. Each time we cool it, it gets closer and closer to minus 160 degrees C. And at that point, it turns into a liquid. And once we have a liquid, now we have the same gas in a volume that's only 1 600th what it started out as. And as a liquid then, we can ship it economically around the world to the end users. We tube electric, we are based in the tube area of Japan, where the economy is steadily growing. And Toyota is our biggest customer. So we need constantly gas or energy constantly. We receive the gas and store it in a very special tank because it's cooled. Then we can vaporize that and send it to the generator, gas turbine. At this moment, we are the most efficient gas turbine probably in the world. And we generate electricity and send it. Millions of people in our supply area do not recognize the origin of the electricity is Qatar, probably the opposite side of the earth, but we are connected to each other. 
The travel time from Ras Lafan to Japan uh, approximately 18 days uh, would vary uh, depending on the weather uh, condition. We'll be going from uh, 12 vessel operation into uh, almost in the range of 45 uh, vessel uh, in operation. We'll start receiving the first Q-Flex uh, 210,000 cubic meter uh, vessel, increasing capacity.